Hey what's up guys, Serge here. So we all know that Samsung has preserved some of the very cool features for their 10th anniversary smartphone and while we are in the Galaxy S9 phase, it doesn't mean that the rumors for S10 will stop. A new report claims that Samsung has teamed up with 3D camera startup Mantis Vision to provide 3D camera sensing technology for the Galaxy S10. Samsung has adopted facial recognition in recent years but the technology isn't enough to serve better and reliably source to replace fingerprint scanner. But Mantis Vision can make it possible as the company's 3D mapping technology was used in Google's Project Tango AR platform. If it's good enough for Google, it should be good enough for next Samsung phone. This new technology will also improve the AR emoji feature that Samsung promises it didn't copy from Apple. The report further adds that the Samsung Galaxy S10 will also have an in-display fingerprint scanner. Samsung was expected to ship this technology with the upcoming Galaxy Note 9 but it has dropped the idea as the technology does not meet the company's standards. All in all, the upcoming Galaxy S10 will be a very special phone as it's the 10th anniversary of the S series which will make it the star of the show and also a memorable phone in the years to come. As per the analysis, the Galaxy S9 Plus costs more to make than the Note 8 even though the Note 8 retailed at a higher price than the S9 Plus at the time of launch. The S9 Plus takes $379 to make while the Note 8 costs $369. Apple's most expensive phone in market, the iPhone X that sells for around $999 costs $389 to make, while the iPhone 8 Plus is the least expensive to make at $324.5. The S9 Plus is still less expensive due to the fact that Samsung mostly uses their own components which relatively downs the cost of their mobile phones. Whereas Apple imports some of the major components such as an OLED panel from Samsung which makes it a bit expensive. But the final cost is decided by the other substantial costs such as R&D, advertisement, marketing, software development cost, etc. Anyways, tell me your thoughts about this in the comments down below and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.